Here you see the knockdown. Quasitas goes underneath, comes up with a left hook, and really Marquez didn't do anything wrong. Just had his right hand down a split second in the middle of exchange. Casitas a very, very good short puncher, just like Marquez. The door was open, yeah, and, it, and he barged in. Yep, but at the end of the round, to me, it looked like Marquez was taking back control of the fight, as he, he's often did, even with the fight. Well, he's shown tremendous resilience. And I Check yourself and what I say you must obey. Good luck. Touch him up. Benos Walker. Hook. Good. Good right hand. Okay. Double jab by double jab right hand. There's the Marquez right hand. Struggled in the opening round. Start letting the hands go. Jab. All oh, these hooks is good work here from Marquez. Terrific body work by Marquez. Nice the attitude here from Katsidis. Punching at air. 722 edge. With about 30 seconds to. Well, folks, he tuned into the right fuck. Uh, fun sick. Watch how he. Hard left hook by Katsidis, and Marquez is on his butt. And seriously hurt. Tremendous and seriously shot. Hurt. The Six, biggest punch Marquez has seven. taken since he fought against and, Pacquiao. Okay. And Katsidis is going to be Come hard to hold off. Michael Katsidis is thinking of his lost brother. Sure. Two minutes left in this round. He's fighting for two. Just as he told us. What an opportunity. Remember that Marquez survived those four knockdowns by Pacquiao. Katsidis caught him with a left hook again. Marquez momentarily wobbled. There's a right cross for Katsidis. Marquez is fighting rather than holding. Marquez is a very experienced fighter. Katsidis have to be careful you said. Marquez is getting his bearings yeah. back. He's going to try to find an opportunity to go right back at Katsidis. But you Hard left hook by Marquez. You remember Juan Diaz did the same thing to Marquez, and Marquez came back and sucked him. So you still have to be careful with him. He's a very dangerous puncher and very accurate. Marquez thinks he has his legs back. We shall see whether he does. Now's the time to go to his body, as he just did. Katsidis is trying to land one more big left hook. That's the punch that started it all. Marquez had been landing so many clean blows that he let his guard down and Bastini's poured through it. And now he's trying to pour it on. Katsidis about to throw some left up or something up through the middle. He's trying to shoot everything over top. Katsidis' punches are traveling wider and wider, and Marquez yeah. is finding opportunities yeah. off the middle. The more Katsidis got into it and thought he had the chance, the wider his punches went. That's not the way you beat Marquez. Good body shot by Marquez. Trying to take the steam out of Katsidis. And there you go, Marquez is coming back very left much hook, like he liked the right same, same as he did with Diaz. Firing away just as he did and coming back in the Diaz fight. What a round. Wonderful job. Here you see the knockdown. Quasitas goes underneath, comes up with a left hook. And really, Marquez didn't do anything wrong. Just had his right hand down a split second in the middle of exchange. Quasitas a very, very good short puncher, just like Marquez. The door was open, yeah, and, it, and he barged in. Yep, but at the end of the round, to me, it looked like Marquez was taking back control of the fight, as he, he's often did, even with the fight. Well, he's shown him. tremendous resilience, and I get... Left hook by Mark. Two more from Cat City. And Marquez, who showed some vulnerabilities. Katsidis dipping and throwing a nice hook. Well, maybe it was a quiet round. These, they just didn't go down. Good round four. Good right hand to the body from Kat. Oh, what a good hook to the body from Marquez. 
Right up a cut from both. Good offensive fighters. Look at the good work on the inside. Upper cuts from both. Marquez won that exchange. Didis is swarming. Marquez doing a bit of a paint job and more. Put fighters on the deck and get on the deck himself. Is a pleasing style. These guys are trying to. Body shots from Marquez. Cat CDs with a hook. Good hook from Cat CDs. Let's keep on going. Good hook to the body from Marquez. Exceptional training being shown by both guys because you can't sustain this if you're not in shape. In the battle of left hooks, as we come to the halfway point. Down with a thunderous left hook in round three. And look at the pace of this fight to be in. To keep this going. The theme for this fight could be don't even bother to jam. I'll meet you on the inside. Left hook uppercut here by Kat Cedis. Marquez digging that hook. Uh, blister. Good right hand by Marquez. Good body shot from Pat Cedis. You take a look at the numbers. The high quality of these shots from both guys in this round, and they've all been hard shots. You talk about two warriors, talk about two guys in great shape. You're seeing it. Every three seconds. Keeping it going. Marquez stumbled. Rounds. And Oh, what work here off the work by Marquez. Terrific uppercut. He hurt Cat Cedis with that one. Big uppercut by Marquez. He's backpedaling. Kenny Bayless will have to take a look. Cat Cedis is hurt. Here comes Marquez. He can smell it. Oh, what an uppercut by Marquez. Snapping the head back. How much will Kenny Bayless allow? And Katsidis' corner is going to have to enter. Now, we've seen something come out of Katsidis. And that's a good move by Kenny Bayless. That's absolutely. An appropriate stoppage, a good move by the referee because he saw a guy who was too proud to go down. But was getting hit with a horrific display of big shots. And Juan Manuel Marquez does it again. Comes off the deck and delivers the goods in round nine. Look at the quality of shot after shot. Driving the head back. The hook. 
And all this time now, Katsidis is not throwing punches. The first time, he's backing up and not throwing. And Kenny Bayless with an excellent stoppage. He saw the difference between a guy being a warrior and then a guy being spent just like that. And he calls it.